Hi, this is Ben Seacrest from Accurate Fishing Products, and today is a knot tying day. We've been tying some knots today, and uh, I've been asked a couple times, how do you go through and attach monofilament leader to braid? Well, the first thing you do is we've just done a little video on tying a bimini. Here's a bimini knot, 20 twist bimini knot, and this is 80 pound braid. So what I'm going to show you how to do is I call it a no-name knot. Everybody's got different um, different ways of describing the knot, but that's what I've always known it as. I learned it a long time ago from someone in San Diego, and it seems to work really well if you're not pulling really super hard on fish. But the key to the knot is take your bimini, make sure that your bimini, both the legs are straight so they're even, pinch it off and form a little loop in your bimini. Okay? Take your leader, pop it through, and pinch it. So you've went right through the middle of the bimini. You pull it off to the side like this, and then depending if you're using smaller leaders, so a smaller diameter leader, or let's say 30, 20, whatever, 40, um, you're going to do more wraps. You can do 8 to 10 wraps on this. If you're using bigger stuff, you can actually get by with fewer wraps, like maybe 6. The key to it is cinching it down. So let me show you how it works. You take, the, you take your leader, you bring it through. We're going to do eight wraps. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Now here's the key to it. See the loop up here that I left? We're going to go through that loop. We're going to pull down a little bit. See how that knot plays? The key here now is to wet the knot. And we're going to grab a hold of this and pull it. Now watch how this knot cinches up. Super clean, huh? Now that knot right there, the key to it is if it's not cinched up, that line will pop right out of that double line that you've done. So you can see how my hands are red. I'm pulling this thing super, super hard. Ah, see it? That is what we call a San Diego knot. And the knot, all you have to do with that knot after that is grab a hold of it and trim the little knob here. So you've got your tag in off, you left a little bit on, very little. But if you, if you, a lot of guys will take a half hitch after that, I don't, I, the knot, very rarely I have a problem with this knot. I'm pulling as hard as I can pull on that stuff and that thing's not going. So this, what we call the no-name knot from San Diego, 80 pound braid, and this is 40 pound Iserline. Just showing you guys a cool knot. Hope this helps your fishing.